Hello everyone, welcome to another new video. Filmora just released another new update, Filmora version 12.3.2. So what's new in this new update? Let's explore this. The first major update is color wheels. Now you can use three color wheels, shadows, mid-tones and highlights to adjust color in your video. Let's see how it works. First add a video into the timeline. Then select video and go color section. Then go color wheels. You can see there are three color wheels appear here. The first one is highlights, the next one is mid-tones and the last one is shadows. You can adjust color according to your video. You can add desired color which you want. Also you can adjust intensity by adjusting this slider. Now check before and after comparison. You can see our video now more colorful than previous. It's a great tool for color grading. I'll make a full video about these color wheels, so stay tuned. Then the next update is color correction algorithm. Now improved color correction algorithm for more natural color. Go basic color section. You can see auto white balance tool have been added. You can click on auto for auto mode. Or you can add manually pick color then adjust white balance. So in this way you can add more natural color to a video. Then the next update is added sharpen mode. Now add a sharpen parameter for making your video or image more clear or softer. To add sharpen, go down in color section and in the adjust option you will get sharpen features. Just increase or decrease the slider for adjust sharpen. It's the best tool for adjust sharpness for your video. Then the next update is LUT intensity control. Now you can adjust LUT intensity with this new tool. First add a LUT in your video. Go LUT menu and add your LUT from this drop down. As you can see our LUT has been applied. Now you can control LUT intensity from this slider. I think it's also a base tool because all the time LUT not gives us proper color. Then you can use this intensity control for adjust based color. The next update is before and after comparison view updated. Now this tool added in our preview panel to compare between color correction edited video and original. Right click on our preview panel and select this tool from here. As you can see our before and after preview is showing. To cancel this, just right click again and select Disable Comparison. You can find this tool here also. One click for Activate and again for Disable. The next best update is Effect Mask. It's the another best update I think. Now you can add mask on your applying effect of any video or image. Let's see how it works. First add an effect on your video. I added square blur for tutorial purpose. Then go effects control and adjust your effect. Then here you can see a icon visible here. That is effect mask. You can add rectangle, circle and custom shape for mask. You can see our effect is now masked. Let's try custom mask. You can also set all parameter for mask.
I think it's the best update for making some new effects. The next update is exporting image sequence. Now you can export individual frame for a video. Let's see how it works. First of all go export option. Then go format and select image sequence. JPG and PNG both are available for these features. Now I'm selecting JPG for tutorial purpose. Then set location and click on export. As you can see our image now exporting. Let's see the output. You can see here all individual frame for this video and it's still exporting. Also you can individually use this for your projects. So it's another best update. Now added many new transition and effects in this update. Go transition and here you can see there's many new transition like camera, glass, Face turning, smoke, etc. You can see here's the camera transition. Now you can make your video more cinematic with this transition. With the transition there's added so many new effects also. So hope you guys enjoy this video. More explanation video for this new update will come into this channel. So stay tuned by subscribing this channel and give a thumbs up for this video. Thanks for watching, goodbye.